Hello, my name is Kelly Antone, PLC Training Instructor with PCC. In this lesson, I will cover comments, go-to, and searching within TIA Portal. I'm going to open up the properties of OB1 by right-clicking and selecting Properties. Here, under the Information area, I can enter in comments for the individual blocks as well. Now I'm going to open up the main program block OB1 by right-clicking and selecting Open. Now, I can enter in the block title. I can put the comments here directly in the ladder editor as well. I can collapse the main block title or expand it. Each individual network in the ladder editor can have comments. I'm going to collapse all of the networks. So these would be all of the networks from the previous lessons that I have gone through. So for network one, I want to put a network title in of simple lad one. For network two, I will put in simple lad two. For network three, I will put in math. For network four, I will put in conversion. For network five, I will put in calculate. Network six, I will put in move. For network seven, I will put in use for watch and force tables. Now I'm gonna expand out network seven. Now you can also put in multi-line comments for each individual network as well. So you've got the network title as well as network comments. So you can put in multiple lines here and then when you minimize the multi-line comment just the first line will be visible. So you can expand that out and then you get all the detailed information. You can also turn off the network comments or turn the network comments back on. Next, I will go to the Network 5 and expand that out because it has a box instruction. So I'm going to right-click on the Calculate instruction and select Insert Comment. This allows me to insert a freeform box comment that can be positioned inside the ladder editor. So I'll just highlight the text inside the box and type in whatever comment I would like to add into the comment box. So freeform comments can be added. The box can be you know, resized. It can be you know, repositioned. And then you also can hide the comments. You can turn free, free comments on and free comments off. I'll minimize Network 5 and now go to Network 7. On Coil Instructions, you can also right-click and select Insert Comment. And now you can put in the freeform comments on Coils as well. I will reposition the comment. Then I will go up and I will turn the comment off so you don't see it and turn it back on. Now I don't want to keep this comment, so I'm just going to use the Undo feature to get rid of the freeform comment for the coil. Comment is now gone. Next I will show you the go to function. So what I'm going to do is right click on switch 3 and select go to. You can select go to network or line but I'm going to select definition. This will actually take you to where switch 3 was defined and now I will enter in a comment for switch 3. I just say this is going to be the third switch on CPU. So now I will close out the editor, right click on switch 3 again. This time I'm going to select go to and pick device view. This will take you to the CPU or module of where this switch is assigned. So in this case switch 3 is on the CPU so it opens up the editor and shows you that the CPU is highlighted. I can use the expand all networks and then scroll through trying to find you know addresses within the logic but that's not the most efficient so I'll just collapse all my networks and just expand out network 7 and show you my target so I'm gonna look for light 3 
So what I'm going to do is go to the task card on the right hand side and then there's the find and replace task card. So what I can do is type in the light three tag and I can start searching in this editor. So this find and replace tab is a search within the specific editor that is open. So that found light three. I will minimize that. Now I will go up on the top and there's search in project. I will type in light three and then press the search button. This will search throughout the entire project, you know, ladder logic, HMI, etc. So it's not just the open editor. You can further refine your results by selecting, you know, filters on. So I could pick just program blocks. Now I will remove the filter condition so you can see it in all the locations again. This concludes the lesson on comments, go to, and searching.